Congratulations on the victory. Palace never make it easy, though, do they? No. And we, in the first half, we did mistakes that uh, the reason is three days, three days, three days, three days, and arrive a moment that. Uh, but we have to do it, make a comeback, and today Kevin won the game. So with his actions, with the goals and assets and everything, he, his talent today was uh, to the team, and we won for him. A hundred goals for Manchester City for Kevin De Bruyne now. Oh, yeah? yeah, I thought that was why you were blowing kisses at him. <laughs> no. Well, it's a guy. He, I don't know if he enjoys more scoring goals than assists. Is a, but uh, always we push him to say you have to win games. You have to win games. And but he won a lot of games for us, no doubt. And and yeah, really good, really good uh, for his performance. You talk about the the problems that you faced in the first half. You found a solution though. What had you spotted that made you bring Akanji on at half time? Yeah, he pushes a lot. Manu was unbelievable playing the left back and proved his potential. So he's an incredible player, and especially the first half, um, we attacked better in the sides. That uh, with uh, Rico and Oscar, they were really good. The young guys in that side and the left also Kevin was being involved. But we had just something. We were lucky to score the second early in the second half, like they scored in the first, give us composure, and after in two in two actions we could we could close the game. Rico Lewis was the player that scored that goal early in the second half. Is that something you'd like to see more from him, adding goals to his game? He's an exceptional player. Rico has something in the middle, in the pocket. This is really, really good. And and uh, he has a sense of goal. He's a guy when the training session arrives in the final third, always has have a, a this potential. He's another academy player and really good for us. Well, you're now unbeaten in 25 games in all competitions. Not only is that important, obviously, for the title race, but also how important is it for momentum as you head into the Champions League next week too? Uh, when we come to the Champions League now, so we'll see which players we have available because the Josco has a little bit of problem, so we will see. Uh, yeah, I think next one. So now is uh, uh, we were lucky. We were lucky to play early on at 12.30 to recover uh, after Aston Villa, but we are lucky because now we arrive early in Manchester for recovery for this, I would say, stupid things, but this is not stupid, they are so important. And yeah, travel to Madrid and and try to, to do a good game and give the the knockout uh, open to Manchester and and yeah, come on. But it was really, really important. Thanks for your time. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.